We looked at polar and rectangular array at previous uh, in previous lessons, and in this lesson we're going to uh, look at the path array, which is uh, used to copy and move objects along a path. Now, I have a poly line here. Notice it's a polyline. It's not a uh, this a usual line. As we see, the polyline is next to that. I'm going to press Escape. Now we're going to create a circle at the end of this polyline and give it a two feet. Now I'm going to launch the array command, path array command which is uh, on the same menu as uh, rectangular and polar array on the modify panel I'm going to click that I'm going to select this select the circle and I'm going to right click now this uh, command take a look at uh, my command line first we says select path curve we're going to select a path curve which is uh, in this case this curve which I've uh, made before I'm going to click that notice AutoCAD is copying and moving that object along that path now we can enter the number of the object we want or we can click at the end of the point I'm going to click at the end of that point now AutoCAD asks us to specify the distance between items along this path we can enter the number or we can select the any point I'm going to select this end point I'm going to press enter to accept that as we see instead of uh, copying and moving all the objects uh, which are certainly many of them and uh, they are probably in many shapes we could use the path array uh, and copy that in this case but before that we have to always create a curve path for that uh, to end up very clean I'm going to pan a little and use that on a practical example now here I've got a some uh, chairs and a curve which represents some uh, very large conference table here we're going to uh, make these lines and chairs end up like this our finished example right there I'm going to enter the array command and select this chair right click select the pass curve and uh, enter the number of items which in this case is 14 enter and for the distance between items I could enter the uh, those in form of numbers or I could pick a point I'm going to pick a point here and point I'm going to press enter relaunch that command select this uh, chair right click select this path 14 of them I want to copy copy that I'm going to pick this point and press enter we're done this is a very efficient way of copying and moving objects uh, which uh, we have to copy them in various kind of uh, path and we could do that easily by path array and we could save a lot of time by doing that.